Hey guys, sorry it's taken a while, welcome back to part 2. So, since I pretty much explained the gameplay on the first one, and this one we're just gonna be, we're just gonna be going through and really just kinda showing you the storyline a little bit for the first two levels. Once it gets a little further into the game, that's when we'll, we'll really, it like, the videos will start getting longer, I guess. That first one was only really long because the whole intro. Alright, so basically you wake up as a Psyduck, you're groggy, you're sleepy, and this is how the game teaches you where you can save at. You can't go outside, can't do anything, oh, but save. So sleeping is saving in this game, essentially. Alright, then you wake up a little later. Feeling refreshed. Then you remember your partner. So you go to check on them. Huh? Oh no. They fell asleep outside your door, waiting on you. Shouldn't have went back to sleep, man. The mailbox is how you receive, like, requests and how you do certain things and go to places. It's an interesting system. Like I said, this is one of my, like, all-time favorite, like, Pokemon games. Like, like, don't get me wrong, I love the main series Pokemon games. You know, like, Pokemon Crystal was, like, one of my first Pokemon games that I can remember. Um, like, Pokemon Yellow, like... Like... But when these, like, it, it was funny when I was a kid, I always said, oh man, I wish they'd give you a game where you could play as Pokemon. I wish they'd give you a game where you could play as a Pokemon. And then, like, eventually this game came out, and I was just like, I got to have this. Truthfully, I had the one uh, Blue Rescue Team, which was on the DS, and they, because they came out simultaneously on the Game Boy Advance and the uh, original DS. I, uh, uh, I beat that one really quickly because the storyline of this actually doesn't take that long. Um, it like clunk. I wonder what it could be. Um, but no, you can get through the actual storyline of the game pretty quickly, and then after that, it's like any Pokemon game. Really, you can, you know, you can kind of just keep playing, keep doing stuff, kind of. Do everything you really can think of doing. I heard about you from Caterpie. Please, we need your help. Magnemite is in trouble. So basically, I gotta go to this cave with this like weird electromagnetic stuff going on that caused two Magnemite to get stuck together. I gotta rescue them. So, like I said, you've already seen the gameplay of how this is done pretty basic um so we're just gonna get through this real quick Oh no, I'm getting hungry. Alright, let's eat some some apples that we've picked up along the way. A belly, nice.
Alright, let's get going. Alright. Got to the end of Thunder Wave Cave. Now we have four happy Magnemites. It's like, man, I'm tired. I'm going to go pass out. See you tomorrow. Alright, and that was day two.